See, I'm just in Puma now. I haven't done like a video on here for a while, but yeah, I've got as long my hair's gone. And it's gone quite long, I think. So yeah, it's like, you know, <laughs> yeah, it feels good. Like I said, being tan today. Like I said, I feel like um, you know, with the swishy hair. I don't think many of you other guys have this. I'm looking at like everyone making a lot different foam, and I thought, you know, do whatever works if you stand out basically. Because um, with the swishy hair, I do feel like I stand out a lot, and I think it's good. I think it's something you should strive towards. Stand out, feel important, feel good, feel unique. I think that's a good way to move forward, you know, do whatever makes you feel special, makes you feel important, makes you feel unique, makes you feel like you stand out. And with this swishy hair, I've been lately feeling that, you know, I stand out a lot. But yeah, it feels good to go out with sort of the old school 70s swish or sort of, yeah, the old school sort of look that isn't in there anymore. You wear a like, Turkish barber today in town, you just don't see this hairstyle and it feels good to go out looking different, kind of feeling a bit different from every other guy. It's just good, it feels good, it feels nice. Got long stuff, swishy hair at 27 and like I said, I've done a few videos in this position but you can sort of tell, yeah. Got my swishy hair, um, yeah. I'm, I'm looking forward to you know growing my hair out and stuff. I mean, I will be getting a hair for the next month, but I'm making the most of it. I've got nice long hair now, make the most of it. Enjoy yourself, be happy, and um, don't let anyone else tell you otherwise. You know, be, be yourself and um, look how you want to look. Don't follow trends necessarily, go with what makes you look best. And I think long, long swishy hair is a no brainer, so yeah.